My name is Sydney and I lead the Global Programme for Compassion International. A few months ago, none of us would have foreseen that the world would be locked in a pandemic. Know that wherever you are and whatever your situation may be, we are praying for you as we navigate this new global pandemic together. One of the things that instinctively we do as believers is to go back to scripture. A scripture that comes to mind is 2 Timothy chapter 1, verse 7. God has not given us a spirit of fear, but one of power and of love and of sound mind. And I suspect that these are the ingredients that are necessary for any of us to navigate this season. We believe you partnered with Compassion because you trust us to minister to your sponsored child through the care of a local church. It's a responsibility and a gift that we do not take lightly. During the COVID-19 pandemic, children cannot meet at the church together, which means they're not receiving the regular and routine support of Compassion's programs. Nonetheless, we have adjusted our strategy to make sure that each child continues to be known and to be loved and protected at this critical time. Local churches across all the countries we are working in are using your sponsorship donations to meet urgent and critical needs for families and children registered in the programs. Funds used previously when the children would meet at the development centers can now be directed as needed to children and their families for critical necessities like food, clean water, shelter, clothing, hygiene and sanitation items, and even medical care and trauma counseling. Your monthly support remains vital in this season. And we commit to give you regular updates each month from each country during this crisis. We believe the local church is the hands and feet of Jesus, bringing his love and grace into people's lives, especially in this difficult season. I want to thank you for your continued giving and your continued praying for your child. I want to assure you of two things, that we will continue to pray with and for you. And secondly, we will continue to do absolutely everything to ensure that your sponsored child is loved, is protected, and is receiving the necessary support during this critical time. Again, thank you.